Watching BBC News with me, Tim Wilcox. The headlines at four. Exam boards say GCSE and A level students will be graded more generously this year to account for COVID. Hospital chiefs speak of their frustration at delays to a plan to tackle the NHS waiting list backlog in England. The 15-year-old killed at a holiday park on the North Wales coast, Amanda Selby's 19-year-old brother, admits her manslaughter. Emmanuel Macron arrives in Moscow for a meeting with Vladimir Putin over the tensions in Ukraine. Also, Ben Wallace and his Polish counterpart uh, hold a press conference about more aid to Poland again over the tensions in Ukraine. Britain sends another 350 troops to the Poland border. And how a spinal implant helped one man walk again and father a child. Good afternoon, welcome to BBC News. GCSE and A-level pupils in England will be given advance information about the topics that will appear on their exam papers this summer. The government has confirmed that for the first time in three years, public exams will go ahead, despite a high number of teacher absences due to COVID. Our education correspondent Elaine Dunkley reports. <laughs> 